What's up guys, welcome to SamCam. Today I'll be showing you guys how to optimize images in Node.js using Shop. So let's get right into it without wasting any time. I'm sure you came just for this, for the code specifically. So Shop, as you can see, you can read more about it, but it definitely does that, it optimizes images. And uh, yeah, we're gonna dive right into that. So you can see, you can see uh, we're getting it from NPM to install it, NPM I, Shop, dash dash save. Okay, and uh, first I'm just gonna initialize. Okay, just initialize NPM. Okay, it's gonna ask us a bunch of questions of which I'm just gonna click enter because it doesn't really matter at this moment. Okay, and then I'm just gonna install shop. Okay, just to be quick. Okay, um, it's gonna take a bit of time, right? not too long though. Okay, waiting for that to finish. Okay, I don't have the best internet connection in the world, but uh, let's, let's wait a bit. Okay, and this is too poor, unexpectedly so. Okay, Okay, I could have paused, but I thought it wouldn't take time, so it, and it didn't take, it take that much time. Okay, once we're done, we're just going to create our app.js file, okay, touch app.js, okay, okay, and then after that, I come in here, and then I require shop, okay, shop, just to require, okay, uh, shop, okay, you're requiring a shop, okay. After that, to use shop, shop is more like an, an, a function, right, which is invoked with an argument of the path of the image that you want to optimize. And our image is, I have two images here, as you can see, I have image, uh, image, and then I have this other one, this beautiful one. Okay, we're going to start with any, I'm just going to start with image, not jpeg, okay, the jpeg. Okay, and uh, it returns an object, or a class, I'm not so sure exactly, but... We can access other methods so after that chain reaction sort of thing okay and then after that we want to resize that's the most important thing uh, resize to for example usually thumbnails are around 200 by 200 okay and uh, then we're going to say to to file okay to file okay and then we're just going to call it out underscore one for jpeg okay and then we save that and then we execute node app Let's execute and see. Do we get something? Uh, yes, we get something. Okay, the original image, remember, it's like this, right? It's it's this way. And this is the output file, which is which is good, but if you can see, it's been cropped, uh, and that can be fixed this way. Now you go to shop, then you, here you pass in some options here. You pass in some options, okay? And then the options that we're gonna pass in here, the option that can fix this for us is fit. Right? By default, the fit option is set to cover, Right, which is what crops our image, but we want to say contain. And uh, let's save that and try it again and see. You can explore more of these options. I'm just giving you guys, okay? And uh, yeah, it did the job, but then let's say you have another problem. You don't like the, the black background, you can change that as well. Not difficult at all. Just go background, uh, background, um, okay? It's an object, R255. Uh, I'm just gonna change it to, to purple. KB 255, K green 0. This is some primary school, elementary school <laughs> stuff we learn, primary colors and their combinations and what they produce. Okay. Uh, okay. And uh, well, yeah, there we, there we go. You can just basically, and then you can also have, you can control the opacity right, with the alpha, but I'm not going to do that. It ranges from 0 to 1. Okay. Okay, and then now I want to resize the other image, uh, image two. Okay, uh, well, and I'll say at the end we're gonna check the file sizes. Uh, please stick around. Uh, like I said, five minutes. Like the title says, five minutes. Okay, yeah, two. Uh, okay, and then we're gonna do this one. Wait, let's just change this to something different. Let's say five, for example. Make it something like that. Okay, uh, new app. Okay, how does it look? It looks like this. You see, put it in the center. But you can change this. You can change this for sure. Uh, let me just be quick about it. The time is running out almost. Okay, and then you can just like basically manipulate the position uh, and just say, I'm not sure if left is available, but let's try. Okay, left, and let me do that. Okay, and uh, let's see now what it looks like. Okay, let's see. Okay, yeah, put it on the left. So basically, you can also change the position of the image as you resize. Yeah, yeah so basically, that, that was it, guys. That was it. Hopefully, I have not. Okay, just to show you the final thing. 
uh, reveal in X file explorer okay just to show you the original file image for this first one was 813 kilobytes and the output was 3.43 kilobytes <laughs> as you can see i'm sure 3.43 kilobytes was the output and then the second image the original was 1.3 megabyte and the output was 9.95 uh, kilobytes which is good so i hope you enjoyed this video please hit like and subscribe to my channel uh yeah hope it was useful